did you meet up with the rest of the boys? I met Paul when I was about 16, I think. I was playing with this group at the church social. Social, church social, agnostic church social. And he just came up, you know, to watch. And he knew somebody that I knew and they introduced us and he knew the words to one of the songs that I didn't know. I said, do you want to join the group? And he did. And then George came about a year later, you know. Ringo, we met in Hamburg. He was playing with another group. And, you know, we thought we'd liked his style, but we'd only just got up the other drummer, so we couldn't do anything about it. But when we got the chance, we did. So. I think the three of you had missed him. This is the impression I've gotten all along, that uh, there was something missing. It was obviously Ringo. Yeah, well, it's, you know, it's bound to be. We've been together now, you know. <laughs> all right. <laughs> And it is funny when one of you is missing, even yeah. though Jimmy did well. Obviously, it's not the same as the four of you together. No. The crowds gave Jimmy a wonderful reception in Adelaide. They did, they were very good. But then when, when uh, I think it was Paul, or was it you, said that Ringo was coming, uh, yeah. they went wild. And then they yeah. quietened down because they realised they wouldn't see yeah. him. Yeah, it's a shame. Yeah.